leech is homemade. In a first video I've seen you how to build this troubleshooter leech and in the present video I will show you how to do yourself a educational leech. This was a very important thing for my dog, a very strong dog and I have to thank you very warmly my friend Ivan who totally changed my life as to the education of my dog. You will notice that I'm wearing here the t-shirt from the Société Nationale des Sauveteurs en Mer. This is a French association helping people in the sea. So in case you are in the mood of giving a donation, don't hesitate. The link is in the description. One little comment about the rope. So here I took a very thick rope. Um, this year is also because my dog is very strong. So that's why it's uh, not uh, excessive to have a very thick rope. Nevertheless, I recommend you, if you have uh, smaller dogs, to take uh, a smaller diameter of the rope uh, because when it's so thick, it's not so easy to make the knots. So please feel free to um, use a thinner uh, rope. Nevertheless, one important thing I wanted to share with you is that this rope is giving a certain form of elasticity to the leech which gives a great comfort compared to classical leeches where there is no flexibility at all. For this uh, educational leech, I'm taking as reference uh, the second model you will see later on. This makes a total of 160 width. Carefully, it has two sides. So that's in reality the double plus the volume needed for making the knots. Uh, what I could keep as a good example from this leech is that this length, this is 130, uh, is quite good for putting the leech around the neck of the dog. Up front, one little comment on the length of the rope. Um, careful when you are measuring the length because you will need some space for making the knots because the knots can take a little bit of space. So I took uh, the reference, so the first part of this leech is 2 times 130. So we're making our first cut. For this I'm taking from the, my basic toolbox the cutter. change the blades of the cutter. First of all, we make a knot for having a place how to hold the dog. More towards the middle. So I'm making this knot more or less at 80 centimeters. to junction. It's a very easy knot. the 
first part of the leech. We should be knowing that this here will be a kind of handle for holding the dog. This here as well, which means that for putting the leech, you just make like this. And this is the neck of the dog. And you're pulling like this, and this will hold the dog automatically. So now we're adding up the second piece. This is around one, one meter sixty. Same knot than before. connecting the two parts of the leech. The part on the top and you will notice that the loop is quite wide so that I can easily put my arm inside. This is the connection between the both parts. Here we have a knot which can serve as a handle and here this one as well can serve as a handle. And the neck of the dog will be blocked like this. In case you see that this knot is too close to the dog, you can then adjust by placing in a different way the top of the leech. And I can tell you this is really very tight. So here for instance the knot is too uh, low. Yeah. That's it my friends, the educational leech is now uh, finished and I will show you in the next video how to make this leech which is more for leisure walks and don't forget to give a little bit of your money to the Société Nationale de Sauvetage en Mer. So see you in the next video for the next leech on Happy Hour TV 1.